tip top of the evening here, folks. How y'all doing? This is me again, it's Jerry, and I am Tate Blade, as I've been quite a bit here lately. But, hmm, let me think about this. What would we be Tate Blade for now? Hmm, it's Thursday night, right? Yes, I believe it is. And you know what we're talking about. Football, folks. All our usual sites are in place. Please, I wish we could find a remote, but, you know. Sometimes remotes kind of loop me from time to time, and you know, that's what I'm looking for right now. Uh, uh, this is not good. Alright, we just had a remote. What do we do with them? <laughs> I guess we'll find them here in a few minutes. Let's go ahead and get through our high school football games. We're going to start like we always do every week. University at Oak Hill. Hmm. You know, I'm not looking for much of an upset here. I'm looking for Oak Hill. Ooh, here's one. Point Pleasant at Winfield. Ooh, nice game here. I like Winfield, believe it or not. Really do. Magnolia at Clay Bertel. Ooh. I like Clay Bertel, believe it or not. I'm looking for an upset. Um... Cowboy Midland at Ravenswood. I'm looking for Cowboy Midland all the way. North Marion at Liberty. Harrison, that is. And that is our game of the week. Folks, that is our game of the week. Week. Um, why did we pick this game? Well... There's a couple of good reasons. Oh, by the way, I just found my remote. I forgot to set purposes. Yep, our remotes, you know. Come on, why did we pick this game? Well, there's a couple of good reasons here. I want to see if Liberty is as good as I think they are. Maybe they, if they win tomorrow night, maybe they can sneak in the playoffs. Uh, East Harden at Pennsboro. Ooh, like this. I like East Harden, believe it or not. Scott at Nitro. Ooh, big game here. I like Scott, believe it or not. I believe Scott can go undefeated. Hampshire County. Uh, AAA at number one, Tucker. I like for Tucker, Tucker to really pull an upset. Uh, Roan uh, County at uh, Oak, Oak, Green, Oak Green. I like Roan County, believe it or not. Greenbrier West at Moorefield. I look for Greenbrier West to go 10 and 9 one a year. I really do. Hurricane at Huntington. Ooh, big game here. And I mean big, big, big. I like Hurricane, believe. I like Huntington, believe it or not. I really think Huntington will be upset. Uh, here's a game we wouldn't mind being at. East Fairmont Senior. I mean, Fairmont Senior at East Fairmont. Ooh, the Battle of Fairmont. As they like to call it. I like, believe it or not, East Fairmont. I really do. I think it's going to be interesting. Willing Central at Williamstown. Look for Williamstown big time. Jefferson at Washington. I like Jefferson, believe it or not. Mount View, single way at Monongah. And, ooh, big game here. I like Monongah, believe it or not. Mingo Central, believe it or not. Really do. That's Mingo that's Mount View at Mingo Central. I like Mingo Central, believe it or not. Bluefield at James Morrison. I like for James Morrison, big time. Uh, Pins Perma at Parkersburg South. Ooh, tough game here. I'm guessing. Parkersburg South. Uh, that would be an upset, but still, I think that's way at Man. Man at Chaplin. I look for Man all the way. Wyoming at Buffalo. I look for Wyoming big time. Bridgeport at Lincoln. Ooh, we'd love to be here. 
no transportation down that way, but I love to go. I like Lincoln. I like I look for Lincoln with the upset. Believe it or not, I really do. I think that's gonna be interesting. St. Mary's at Ravenswood. I like St. Mary's all the way. Logan at Hunt at Herbert Huber. I like Kiver Huber, believe it or not. Band at Tigers Valley. Ooh, tough be here. I like Tigers Valley, believe it or not. Uh, Hedgesville at Spring at Spring Mills. I like Hedges. I like Spring Spring Mills, believe it or not. Lewis County at Grafton. Yeah, if I gotta go with something here, I'm gonna go with um, I'm going to go with Grafton. they got to pick up a win here eventually. <laughs> uh, Peyton, Peyton County at Cameron. I like Cameron all the way. Uh, Frankfurt at Kaiser. I like... Ooh, yeah, I'm looking for an upset. I like Kaiser, believe it or not. Dodger County at Tower Consolidated. Ooh, big game here. I mean, big, 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 big game. If I like anybody, I like Tyler. I like Dodger County, believe it or not. But don't cut Tyler Scott and don't count out Tyler Consolidated. I want to pick that as my um, throw my um, field goal game of the week in high school football. We're not quite done yet. Uh, Folks, I'm going to show you this team because it's it just, I have no idea where the heck they're from. I'm going to pick Morgantown over this team, but I have figured it out. This team's got to be from up north somewhere. And I'm going to say Canada. That is on North American territory, just for the record. And this game will be played in Morgantown, North American Territories. So I like Morgantown. Just to cover international law and just to cover, just to, just, you know, just keep, keep us out of trouble. Braxton County at Clay County. I like Clay County, believe it or not. We're at Westbrook County. I like Westbrook County, believe it or not. Philip Barbara at Preston. I like Philip Barbara all the way on this one. Can't argue with that. Pikeview at Nicholas County. I like Nicholas County, believe it or not. Peyton City and Peyton County and Pocahontas County at Midland Trails. Tough game here. I'm going to go look for Midland Trails. Uh, Wheeling Park at John Marshall. Hmm. I like Willing Park, believe it or not. Robert C. Bird and Elkins at Robert C. Bird. Yeah, I look for, I look for Robert C. Bird. Madonna at Calhoun County. I like Madonna, believe it or not. St. Aubin's at Spring Valley. Yeah, I look for Spring Valley. Polka at Wayne. I like Polka, believe it or not. Really do. Karras County, Virginia at Middle Bridge. I like Middle Bridge, believe it or not. I really do. Here in Virginia is a U.S. territory. You have to mention it every week. Woodrow Wilson at George Washington. Ooh, tuppy, 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 tuppy. I like George Washington, believe it or not. That's my second field goal game of the week. Sistersville at Westside. I like Westside, believe it or not. Glen County, Virginia at M McLean. I like McLean, believe it or not. really do. And yes, just for the record, once again, Virginia is a U.S. territory. Uh, Parkersburg at Musselman. Ooh, tough game here. I like Parkersburg, believe it or not. I look for the upset, sort of, in a way. 
they were the regional at Wyoming East. Yeah, I like Wyoming East, believe it or not. Valley Wetzel at Peyton City. I like Peyton City, don't get me wrong. Well, I think it's going to be quite interesting there. I'm surprised Peyton City is not right from the way their record stands. Interesting. Lincoln County at Greenbrier East. Mm, I like Greenbrier East. Uh, I, I like Greenbrier East, believe it or not. 100 at Richie Wood. Mm. Yeah, I like Richie Wood, believe it or not. Capital at South. Oh. Yeah, I have to say it. Capital at South Charleston. Hmm. You know, as crazy as this season's been for South Charleston, I gotta pick them. Just so they can pick up a win this year. Pray to God for that. Richie County and Sherman. I like. Uh, Richie County, believe I don't like Sherman, believe it or not. Gilmer County at South Harrison. Now, this is going to be wild. Yeah, I'm looking for South Harrison just to break even five and five on the year. Really am. That would be kind of nice for those guys. But don't count Gilmer County out of it. Our final game of the night is Riverview at Tulsa. Yeah, I like for Tulsa to, to pull the. I like Tulsa just to break even at five and five on a year. Really do. I think that. Those are your triple A, double A, and single A games of the week in the great state of West Virginia. And as I've often said over the years, folks, I get nothing. I get nothing for recommending anything. Let's just. Um. Basically, right now, I'll just go through and see if um, anything is playing on the thing. If we can get get our scores out like we usually do. We can get our usual scores out. And if anything looks interesting, we'll throw it out. Uh, we got a college football game on ESPN. Wake Forest at, I didn't see, Wake, Duke at Wake, uh, Wake Forest at Duke. Ooh, interesting game here. And it's all tied up, 21 all. That's in the fourth quarter, uh, $5.57 less than change in regulation. That might be a good game to turn to and see if that thing goes overtime. Love that. Uh, college football again. And we got another one here on ESPN2. This is Southern Alabama at Toro. And Toro's on top, believe it or not, Southern Alabama, 14 to 10 at this time. That's about nine minutes and nine dollars and fifty six cents left to go in the fourth quarter of that one. So that might be a good one to turn turn to. Let's see what they do here. First down and more. Okay, that's cool. And folks, as we go through our usual setbacks here on Thursday night, uh, let's see. Anything else might be interested? Uh, let's see. College football. Let's see. This was TCU at Texas Tech. And oh, this is a tight one. TCU on, and the correction, Texas Tech's on top of TCU. U at 3528. Wow. And that's in the second, wait a minute, hang on, fourth quarter. About 52 cents left to go in this one. And I think it might be an interesting little ball game here. That's on uh, Fox Sports 1, in case you were wondering what channel we were looking at. Like I said, uh, tomorrow night we'll be doing our college fix, as we usually do. And on FETV, Emergency's on right now. So if you like to watch that, that's great. It's always a great show. 
Um, well, we got another NBA here. Let's see if we can get a score here real quick. And find out who the heck's playing. Because sometimes this channel does not do it. San Diego Spurs at the Phoenix Suns right now. Right now, that as we speak, that's on the NBA TV channel. And right now, um... The Sun, uh, correction that, the uh, San Diego, San Diego Spurs are on top, 25-15, that's in the, uh, let's see, that's in the what, first quarter, so, you know, that game's just getting started, see so if you may want to check that out, and let's see, anything else? That might even be interesting for, to us. <laughs> Just to throw something out here on GSN, Game Show Network, it's a family feud. So you may want to watch that. It looks like a marathon there. Let's see, anything else? That might even conquer Clock Rangers. A live racing nightcap that started at night, 21 hours. It goes until 2 a.m. in the morning, so we want to check out the nightcaps. What's international racing on top of that? Folks, those are your um, scores for tonight. And um, after this, I'll throw something out for the kitties. The Patrick Show is currently on Nickelodeon Tunes. Too, so you may want to check that out as well. <laughs> and also, what's on after that? I'm just curious. Uh, Cameron, uh, Camp Cameron, and then SpongeBob. So you may want to check that out. I always like throwing something out for the kitties. You know, it's just me. It's how I am. I really like to do that. I think it's a nice gesture. This is Jerry, and I have been, um, and just go through a couple things, just go through a couple things here before we close out our show tonight. There will be a ball game tomorrow night, North Marion comes to Liberty, so we're going to go watch that one. We're also going to go watch, um, well, we're also going to go watch, listen to me, we will have a football circus we'll have a football circus scoreboard show tomorrow night folks I do realize this is coming towards the end and you know for the regular season I have to say this we've done you some throwers this year and I mean that we have done you yes you in America all around the world. We've given you great games. Plus some blowouts. You know, it had to happen eventually. You knew. And anybody who knows football the way I do knew it had to happen eventually. Truthfully. You know, and I'll be announcing some award. Well, not officially, but. I mean, officially, I mean, we won't be giving handing out any awards, but you know, we have some candidates for game for focus, football circus scoreboard game of the year. And like I said, we're in our eleventh week, folks. We have seen it all this year. I think one of the big runnings for um, football game of the year, as far as that goes, it. My hats will go off to Liberty and Philip Barbara. Based on the simplest fact that, that we had two run backs in that ball game. Literally back to back. And if you'd like to check the, any of my games out, you can check it, you can check all my games out on my YouTube channel and my Facebook page. And yeah, this is why I do this. Folks, I'll be honest. I do this for a lot of reasons. I do this for you. The people. 
No, I don't ask for anything stupid. I don't ask for any money from me in these schools. Schools, I don't ask for anything from. I just don't. I just don't. Because I do this as a public service to people. All around the world, I do this as a public service. For the simplest reason. Because I know people can't get to ball games sometimes. And it's always been a ball game. You know, everywhere I go, it's always a good ball game. Some blowouts this year, but what else is new? But that's what happens in the football scene. And, you know, I never, i got to be honest, I never keep track of my, um, of my odds. I've been doing this now for a little over seven years. I mean, correction, a little over eight years. You know, I've been doing this for about eight years now. I mean, put aside the pandemic that we can only do two shows. But I'm glad we're doing three this year, sometimes four. You know, church videos are always a give me on my channel. Heck yeah. But, you know, there is something else. You know, the holidays are fast way approaching. I hope everybody has a safe Halloween I hope everybody has a great Veterans Day. Yes, we'll be taping delayed a few veteran things here in the great city of Clarksburg. That's guaranteed. We'll also probably be doing something real special for Thanksgiving. I haven't decided on what yet, but we'll do something nice for Thanksgiving. And, of course, you know, the holidays are always around the corner, and Christmas is just around the corner. And, yes, there is another winter fest this year in the city of Clarksburg. We'll be doing that. I would like, if it's possible, to maybe get down to the Lumberport uh, Christmas Parade. I think that would be kind of sweet to do another one of them. And also, don't forget, the tablet will be with us. And we'll do it again this year for the Christmas parade in Clarksburg. We'll probably have to finish up on like on this like we did last year. And you never know, we might do something special for New Year's. <laughs> and we might be doing something special for New Year's. And you know, New Year's, um, New Year's Day, New Year's, New Year's Night, um, we'll be doing our first live of 2024, that's guaranteed. Just want to give you some, just want to give you a discretionary. And also, this is like to throw this out for general purposes. You know the holidays are coming up. So... Dress up a little bit. You know what I mean? Do something that you usually would not do during the holidays. I mean, something you would not do during the regular, you know, during, during the rest of the year. If you're going to wear something, wear something smart. And wear something cool. And if you live in this part of the country, wear something warm. <laughs> But, do yourself up for the holiday season. And this is where I want to finish this video with this. Do something. Do something nice. Wear something that you normally would not wear during the regular year. That could be anything. And I truly mean anything. You name it, it's out there. Well, this is Jerry, and I have been tape delayed. Sorry, we got a little bit off the football line there, but you know how things get every once in a while. Well, sometimes we get a little crazy. And I want to thank everybody for watching the um, three videos that I've had out on the um, Robinson Grand Theater um, 
community um, free concert series that they did. Yeah, well, I'd like to thank thank y'all for watching that. Appreciate that as always, and also thank you for watching my videos because I make them for you all every week. And don't forget, we'll have the football circuit scoreboard show, and we're making progress towards our 324 videos by the end of next year. Peace. Go Reese for peace. Aloha. We still have men and women swimming around the world in our branch of U.S. military. And the brands, we love you madly. Peace out. We'll talk to y'all soon. We promise you that. We're out of here. Peace out.